Good afternoon everybody, it's Hubert Novak again from True Nano and here today I'm at the uh, Glen Ira Joyce Park which I'll show you around in a moment. They have a graffiti problem in this particular wall again which I'll show you and we're here to coat the wall with anti-graffiti to prevent it from uh, having to be repainted again. Just can be wiped down. We'll move back here now so you can see when I apply the Nano Graffiti Armour the colour restoration in the actual green will be amazing. Well, good afternoon. My name is Hubert and I'm from True Nano. Um, I'm back here at Joyce Park a couple of weeks after the wall's been coated with uh, the wall behind me with uh, Nano, True Nano Graffiti Armour. And I'd like to do a few demonstrations to show you how easily it comes off, graffiti that is, and the wall remains unharmed. Okay, I've placed, um, this is a permanent marker, which is a Pentel permanent marker, felt tip type. Um, I'll leave that there for a few minutes while it's drying. I've marked the wall now, and what I'll be simply doing is using a citric based cleaner to take that off. You'll see the graffiti will more or less run off the wall as soon as I spray the citric cleaner straight onto the permanent marker. So as you can see there, that's run straight off the wall, not even sticking to it, and I'll wipe it down with a clean rag. Now as you can see, the rag is only taken off the graffiti and not the paint. Okay, the next thing we'll try, we'll do a different spot. We'll just go over here somewhere and we'll try some paint, enamel paint, black and blue enamel paint. So I'll um, spray that on so you can see what I'm doing. There you have it. The, walls, the wall is nice and clean again. It doesn't need repainting. Hi everybody, this is the bin that I coated a couple of weeks ago as well with uh, the graffiti armour. And again I'll use a permanent marker on this to show you how easy it is to remove without taking the paint off. So if I write my little name here, like so, I can spray it on, same, same thing will happen. And again, using just some citric cleaner. And you can see there's no paint that's come off with that. Now I'll move across to the other bin, which has also been tagged, but hasn't been protected with our product. And I'll show you what the difference is. This is a bin that hasn't been coated with graffiti armor. And as you can see, there's two tags on here, somebody's done. Now I have the same cleaner 
and I try and remove these two tags. They will come off eventually. I have to rub a lot harder. But as you can see, the green paint of the bin is coming off. Which, unfortunately, you can't prevent from happening. I'll finish this off. <laughs> Freebie. Even though I've tried my best, it's, it still leaves a shadow. So that's the difference between no graffiti armour versus graffiti armour.